Good to have you back too. Goodbye, the pony. We have landed on the ship for all these organons, and they don't seem to pay attention to us, which is good. I'm finally on my way to Elysium, together with Gold. Somehow, this isn't quite how I'd imagined the journey. What about drinks and light refreshments? That's <laughs> funny. They won't let me through. Yeah, too bad. We'd better turn back then. We were willing to try. That's what counts. Let's see what Pokey had to say too after uh They're doing this. what they do best. They're standing in my way. Oh wow. Um, excuse me. Mind if I uh I hate to interrupt, but uh Hello? Attention! Bailey oh. <laughs> von Deck! Division, halt! Yes, yes sir, sir Bailey! Oh, yeah, I mean that. <clears throat> well done! Oh, nice! Let's see. Looking good! Better! Much better! <laughs> Did you see that? They listened to me! Can they fetch sticks too? <laughs> I'm not gonna try that. Bad experience? Yeah, I, I don't want to talk about it. <laughs> Let's see what Pokey has to say. The showdown chapter, finally. This is the high bow to Elysium. Uh, in fact, and I don't uh, want to spoil things by saying that, uh, it's the last chapter. Even if they didn't manage to shoot the tank right to Elysium, uh, they've at least hit the high boat, and that means Rufus is eventually on his way to Elysium. Wait a minute. Okay, what? Well, speak your mind, Cole. What is it? Where am I? What? You're waiting in the car. You're sitting right there. All Rufus has to do now is finding a way past all those organons to the bridge, and all will be resolved, and you will just keep waiting in the car. Yeah, exactly what a protagonist is supposed to do. Y you gotta keep watch of those other deponians in the back, and also you're not in disguise. So, um, I mean, uh, Rufus is disguised, you're not. And that's it. This is the final chapter. Yeah, the final chapter. I was out cold the whole time, dead, a toddler, or... You could keep watch of the other deponians. And uh, anyway, the magnitude of a role is not uh, determined by the lines of text. This is a question of importance and uh, gravity. And uh, actually, I'm convinced that Deponia is, in fact, a gold story. Yeah, go gold is the one making the calls and facing the great conflict. Rufus doesn't go through much change. Uh, he's a hero right from the beginning. He stays a hero and he single-handedly saves the world. With the help of Cole, of course, who plays a very important role by staying in the car. In terms of quantity, maybe she didn't have that many lines, but uh, quality, yeah, yeah. You have got to give credit to the quality. Story of an actress's life, yes, brilliant. So that was it, and I didn't even get to say anything during the commentary. But, but, that, that, that's not set in stone. We, we still have a few screens left, but, but let's move on with the game for now, okay? Now that was one of my favorite pokey commentary <laughs> would go to. That's so true. She's always either knockout, turn to baby or whatnot. Wow, so sounds like we are really, really getting close to the end of the oh, story. Crap. More of them. Uh <laughs> in the uh, attention daily on deck. <laughs> Uh, hello? Uh, Bailey von Deck! Yeah, we've noticed. Tell us something we don't know. Really? Mind your manners, will you? A little more respect for our bailiff. <laughs> right. <laughs> yep. He's got a point. After all, he's the bailiff. <laughs> yes, exactly. I'm, 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 after all, I'm the, I'm the bailiff. Uh, remember that. Oh no, the real hand, I think, is standing right be behind. Let me see. What is going on with the Dinich? Bypass the Organauts. Alright, to the bridge we go. Let's do this. Uh, let's uh. Oh crap. More of them. 
I'm headed for the bridge. Take me to the right level. But Bailiff, you should know what level that is. Yes, of course I do. I just wanted to test whether you know it too. Okay, let's go, uh... I think it's up. I'm gonna try it down for this. Oh, this might be a puzzle thing. I'm headed for the bridge. Take me to the right level. But babe, you should know. Yes, of course I do. I just wanted to. Alright, let's stop it. And is this the right floor, Bailiff? You should know that, being a bailiff and all. Ah. <laughs> of, of course. Uh, of, of course. Are you completely sure about that? Of course I'm sure. I'm the bailiff. I'm always sure. Good to know. Time to disembark, everyone. The bailiff says we're here. Um, let me guess. Oh, Cletus? No, Argus. You guessed it. And you must be Rufus. Some nerve you've got coming here. Foolhardy and stupid. As always, or don't you realize that I will now have to break every single one of your bones? Wait! Can't we come up with a, a more peaceful solution? I don't think so. The time for amicable agreements has expired. I've been looking forward to this day. Put him up! Oh, 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 oh. Oh, wow. We gotta buy him. What was it? Pedal? Just you wait. Ow! Ow! Okay, that's not working. <laughs> How about this? Just give up. Alright, I guess our new choice is it. That would. What have we here? A throttle valve to adjust the elevator's speed. Well, who needs that kind of thing? Oh. Ow! Hey! Ow! Ah. Oh. Here we go, here we go. <laughs> this is funny. What, that, what happened if I let this run? For the next one hour, that is your thing. How about this? Well, you know what? Maybe we could, uh, and then, and then. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Bailiff, at last. The team is waiting impatiently. W waiting? For your speech, of course. And allow me to add that I am no less excited myself. Your speeches are always so inspiring, so eloquent. You play the crowd like a, a virtuoso plays his piano. And if I may say so, a less charismatic orator would literally be torn to pieces by such an audience. <laughs> he would? Oh, certainly. But your words are like magic. Inimitable. <laughs> but here I am, just raving on. You should get started before the crowd grows even more agitated. Yeah, yes, nobody wants that. Electrifier, work your magic. Guys, uh, just a moment. I, I, I think, um... Gentlemen, we are about to be addressed by our great role model. Our leader. Our mentor. Our idol. Bailiff Argus! Who just a moment ago personally assured me that the speech he's about to deliver will inflame your hearts for our common cause. And now, stand to attention! You are now being addressed by Bailiff Argus! He knew this, and he just let me walk into it. What an ass! Um. Yes, uh. 
What an... Well, I mean, that... Uh, us. I mean, yeah. Uh, <clears throat> what I'm trying to say is... That, 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 um... Us. <laughs> this is so funny. <laughs> uh, who is standing in front of you? Ah, I wonder... Let's see, let's make this as funny as possible, I guess. <laughs> this was quite pretty funny already. <laughs> How about this one? Is only one of the 11,000 asses aboard this ship. <laughs> Does it matter if we choose the right one? Or is there a wrong one actually? I don't know. Let's just try it. <laughs> this one is funny. Um... The Organon is an organization of asses! That's how we were constructed! That is our destiny! I know, I know. Why is he saying those things? Well, this is why. Just look around. What are we actually doing here? We're supposed to destroy a planet for which we don't give a rat's ass. For people who don't mean shit to us. Isn't it time to realize that we are the asses here? Then why don't we do what is expected of us? And shit on them! Come on, say it! We don't give a shit! I could name you a thousand more examples. The fact is, we're the asses here. But is that something to be ashamed of? I say, no! I, for my part, am proud of what I am. I am an ass! And you're all asses too! It's time to show the world what's inside us! Long live the Illuminon! <laughs> Was it good? Very inspiring, like always. Great. Well, then I can go now. Uh, which way to the bridge? But, uh, what about the hymn? The hymn? Exactly. Following each of your speeches, you lead us in our hymn. You can't have forgotten. Uh, uh yes. The hymn. <laughs> <coughs> Me, 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 me. <laughs> Here we go. Organon. Oh, Organon. Oh, oh. Organon. This is a mini game. Organon. <laughs> this is funny. <laughs> okay. Let's see what we supposed to do here. What a lame audience. Amazing scene voice is placed on these people. Okay. <laughs> so out of pitch notes until melody comes out pop. Okay, well let's see. Organon. Oh. Organon. oh I see. Oh oh Organon. Organon. Oh, How do I know oh, when it's right? Oh, wait, the heart? Oh, oh, organon, organon, oh, organon, oh, oh, or, 
Organon. 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 You know what? Let me put all the off notes on the top. Organon. 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 Let's try it. I see. I think hard is the right note. So. Organon. Oh, organon. Oh, I missed that one. Oh, oh. Organon. Organon. Oh, organon. Oh, oh. Organon. Okay. Organon. Oh, organon. Oh, oh. Organon. Organon. There we go. Organon. Almost got it. Oh, oh. Organon. Nice. This may be it. Organon. Oh, organon. Oh, one more. Oh, oh. Organon. Organon. Oh, organon. Oh, oh. Organon. Oh, I didn't realize we could go. <laughs> there we go. Ah, Cletus, there you are. Where's your mysterious companion? I had hoped you would introduce me to the person who caused us so much trouble. Don't worry, she's on board. You should be more worried about the others who are also on board. Your precious bailiff Argus has moved the entire organ onto this high boat. What? That can't be true. Where is that traitor? You know, I've got good news and bad news regarding him. The bad news is someone's got to clean the floor of the elevator shaft. I don't think that will be necessary. Argus, I don't believe it. You are trying to deceive me to bring the organ on to Elysium behind my back. Yeah, but he didn't reckon with me. Or me. What's going on here? Who is that? I'm the real Cletus. He's just an imposter, which, strictly speaking, makes no difference. Plus or minus two zeros. My calculation turned out just right. This high boat is now under my control. Not as long as I can prevent it. Stop that! This high boat is no longer bound for Elysium. What? 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 I'm certainly not going to jeopardize the Utopian project by taking an invading army to Elysium. I'm initializing the destruction of Deponia. Right now, Elysium will have to start on its journey a little sooner than expected. Stop! Ulysses! You fool! This is madness! My decision stands! Don't try to stop me! But... But what? Oh, my. But what about the Deponians? When you detonate Deponia, what will become of them? Enough energy to catapult Elysium towards the nearest inhabitable planet, I hope. Have you no conscience? Oh, I do, most certainly. But it is necessary. And you are not going to change my mind. But... But what about the Organon? What about it? The Organon was destined to be blown up all along. Ah, uh, I forgot. But... But 
What about me? I don't want to die. I know. You're the third prototype, aren't you? Yes. The tragic fate of the Alpha Generation has always fascinated me. That's why I took Argus under my wing back then. You may think you aren't one of them, but actually, it has always been your destiny to die, just like the rest of the Organon. And the fact that you don't want to die is simply due to a flaw in your design. But... But what about you? You're gonna die as well! True, but this is a sacrifice I'm willing to make. With all the suffering I have caused, I don't deserve better. Ha! Huh. So you've got a conscience after all! You don't have to do this! Oh yes, I do. But... That is Gleva, really scary. Why would you want to sacrifice yourself for the Elysians? Who or what is forcing you? I mean, Deponia may be no paradise, but it's possible to live there, and many people do. And not everyone down there was as unhappy as me. I know. I know the life down at the surface. I spent a long time there myself. Like a rat amongst the garbage. That isn't a dignified life. Not for... For a bunch of stuck-up swellheads? Hey! If you really want to know, this is about my daughter. She lives on Elysium. I want a better life for her. On Utopia. I'm doing this for you, Goal. <gasps> no! You old fool! What have you done? What do you think? In a few minutes... A radio signal will be emitted from this high boat. It will activate all the blast towers around the planet. Deponia will be destroyed. And Elysium can finally set out on its journey to Utopia. I saved my daughter. That's what I have done. I'm afraid I have to contradict you, Dad. Go? What? What? How? I went to Deponia with Cletus. I knew you would never permit it. That's why I didn't tell you. The girl we were looking for was you! The one who took pity on these junkyard dwellers and sabotaged our plans? This was about you the entire time? Can't we celebrate this family reunion some other time? Deponia may blow up any minute now! Including us! And your precious daughter! Exactly! What are you waiting for, Ulysses? Abort the detonation! But that's... impossible! Can't we stop it somehow? The only way would be to destroy the antenna before the signal has sent! The transmitting antenna? Of course! But the transmitter is on top of the upper deck! It would be a suicide mission! Who would be crazy enough to try? I'm in. So am I. And I. Well then, what are you waiting for? I'm coming too. You're staying here, Missy. You and I are going to have a serious talk. Oh wow, what a twist of event! Ulysses is Gold's dad? Hey, wow! <laughs> Let's see what oh bypass Argus to the bridge. Now Ulysses of Argus Treasury, okay. The straight the transmitter. Go to Elysium with go. Alright, so we gotta stop this detonation. Able transmitter okay when we come back we'll do exactly that and i really appreciate all your support and for watching you are amazing and be sure to click on the button below to like subscribe for new videos and share until next time keep on playing and i will see you very soon